This tutorial is part of our full stack React Django DRF channels project, DJ Chat. You can watch this tutorial and many more from our YouTube course playlist, or the whole course, including access to additional resources from our Udemy course. The Udemy course link, which provides the best price for the course, is in the video description. It's probably not uncommon nowadays that websites are viewed more in smaller screen sizes than the larger counterparts of laptops and desktops. Material UI has a built-in function for changing the font sizes whenever the application is viewed in smaller screen sizes. So here in the Material UI documentation, you can access this page through typing in in the search responsive font sizes, you can see that there are some font variants that will be responsive depending upon the view size, the browser window size, sorry. So here we start at 1,600 pixels and you can see that when the browser moves to less than 1,200, the fonts that are set here, H1 to H6 and subtitle one, they will be responsive. So they will actually be reduced in size. Now, this is a really useful feature that we can indeed override if we like, but this by default isn't enabled. So we need to enable this and then we can start to see the font sizes being reduced at smaller screen sizes. Now, it really does make a, a big difference having responsive fonts, particularly if you've got quite large fonts on a desktop view. You don't want that font size to be replicated on mobile, so you definitely want to shrink it. So having this feature built in is really useful. Uh, most definitely. So uh, what we need to do here then is bring in the responsive font. So let's go into our theme. Let's go into theme here and we just need to bring in the tools for that. So that's going to be responsive font sizes. There we go. So like I said, you can override the sizes. So if you wanted to make those changes, you most definitely could do. Um, so at the bottom here, let's go ahead and just enable that. So to enable that, all we need to do is take our theme um, just before we return the theme here. So let's uh, run our theme through responsive font sizes. Theme, pass in our theme. There we go. And that's pretty much it. So let's just see this in action. If we open up, you don't have to do this, but I'll quickly show you in templates. So here we selected the variant H6. And we saw that didn't really change much. So I'll just select H1 for now. You can see it's pretty big here. Uh, so we're back in Chrome, I think. Yeah, oh no, we're not. Okay, let's go back into Chrome. So if I right click and just inspect, you can see here in the styles, in actual fact, it's already been moved up to font size 5.3, 556 rem. And you can see that if I move this down, you can see the font size here at the bottom right, you can see that's being reduced, indicating that the font is actually shrinking for a smaller screen size. There we go. Like I said, you might want to customize that, but the default is fairly good and we're going to be working with the default. We aren't going to be customizing that for this project. 